and gentlemen, the Jeff Matika Show, featuring Jeff Matika. Since you've been around the world, have you ever tried a fried tarantula? I've never tried one. What are some of the interesting uh, delicacies from uh, exotic lands that you have tried? I had uh, Polish nachos not too long ago. How do you feel about Pop-Tarts? I like Pop-Tarts. Toasted? <laughs> yeah, I think toasted is probably the best. What was the first song you wrote from the trilogy? Oh, God. Stay the night. <laughs> if you had to write a song about laundry, what would the first line be? Uh, my socks are dirty, so I need to do some laundry. I've noticed you can get a little life out of a t-shirt on tour. You don't really stink as bad as the rest of us do. Really? Is that true? That's very true. Oh. Is that, a, is that a question or a compliment? That's a compliment. Thank you. <laughs> Let's see, here's a question about the Sex Pistols. I don't know, that might be touchy. <laughs> <laughs> Do you like roller coasters? <laughs> um, yeah, I like roller coasters, but I like old roller coasters. I like uh, the, the Giant Dipper in Santa Cruz. <laughs> White Wolf rode some roller coasters just yesterday, I believe. How'd that treat you? Great. <laughs> well, are you planning any uh, musical collaborations in the future? Um, I have one musical collaboration, but I'm hesitant to say anything right now. Is it with me? <laughs> I think it's with you. There, I said it. No way! <laughs> Special treat tonight, musical guest, classic Hugo, and the Dirty Dick Beaters. Take it away, boys. Is it important for you to have your family on tour with you as often as possible? Yes, yes, I think, I think it is important because I, I get to about uh, seven or eight days and I start losing my mind. So, so then uh, it's time for the family to come out. And they do, and it's nice, it's fun, they're out right now, we're having a really good time. Hilarious. If you had had daughters, Instead of sons, what would their names have been? Um, I think for Joey, I think we were thinking about actually Fina as a <laughs> <laughs> as an as a name. And Jacob, I can't remember. Yeah, probably just Jacob. Still with a middle name Danger though. Oh Which, baby, yeah. Naming a girl her middle name Danger is probably not a good idea. White Wolf, care to chime in? Yeah, I agree with him 100%. So I know you recently produced the Emily's Army album, Lost at 17. Mm -hmm. How did you enjoy that experience, and do you look forward maybe to producing any more albums in the future? Um, I think eventually I'd like to produce something, but uh, I had a, uh, a, it was a really fun 
uh, with the guys, and I've, I've known all of them literally all their lives, and um, they write really good songs. I wouldn't have done it if I thought their songs sucked. Um, yeah, or, you know, so it was fun, and they, you know, they're on a, a good label, and um, they had a, a pretty cool budget with them, and uh, yeah, it was great. Excellent. White Wolf has a demo he'd like to share with you before you leave the studio today. Okay. Make your words broken. <laughs> <laughs> <Come on>. No way. <laughs> you wish. Any chance we'll ever hear Dirty Rotten Bastards live? You wish. <laughs> <laughs> um, I hope so. One of these days we'll, we'll do it. Um, it's uh, up to... Yeah, I got to talk to Mike and Trey about that and see how they feel about it. But maybe the whole set will be Dookie and Dirty Rotten Bastards. Dirty Rotten Dookie. That's brilliant. Mm. Was it fun being in This Is 40? Yeah, yeah, that was really that was a good time. The real fun was is the stuff that I did with Paul Rudd when we just we were talking in in the in at the record label, which got cut out of the movie, but they put it on something. Uh, but that was really fun. Do you? Uh, see He's a funny guy. He's super funny. You see yourself doing any more acting uh, in the future? I have no idea. Uh, maybe if it's if if it's fun, then I, I'd like to do it, and uh, you know. I'd like to do something on Broadway again. I think that would be really fun. You wish. We'll be right back after a brief word from our sponsors. This is Chris. He's Jason White's tech. What do you call this thing you got here? Uh, this is called a guitar. Wow. Well, it's got a six string, huh? It's got six strings. Moved your guitar boat from the left side, and it's on top of 776 now between uh, the two guitar modules, Jason White's, now it's yours, and now Billy Joe's. You lost me. <laughs>